welcome back to the channel welcome back to the vlog happy new year this is my first trip out now of 2022 and as you can see here behind me it's quite a wild day here in cork where i've come to is ballycotton and it's a photograph paradise in reality you can get shots of this lighthouse from all different areas around the whole coastal area here but today i'm looking to see if i can capture some of the wildness in the waves that are there it's quite windy as well now at the moment so i've had to move myself around you're now protected by a cliff face that's behind you here which is blocking the wind but it's something actually i think that i will get some nice photographs of today i am actually going to be utilizing my uh, long lens as well today so i'm using my uh, 70 200 and i'm going to be zooming in on a sequence of rocks you can see waves just breaking on them here so hopefully i'll get some nice shots in relation to that and i hope as well that i get some nice light as well as the afternoon will progress right now it is three o'clock so i'm an hour and a half away from uh, sunset approximately and i am getting nice pockets of light as well as you can see it's been lit up here now behind me at the moment so i'm going to see what type of photographs i can get today play around with some different compositions anyway and hopefully able to capture some of the wildness in the movement in the water that you can see behind me at the moment so yeah that's what we're doing let's go let's see how today goes What have I been doing so far? I have been watching these waves crash below me and I've managed to get a couple of nice shots, I do think, of the water crashing on these rocks that are on the side of the island over where the lighthouse is and also as well coming right around me here and breaking up over almost on top of me. It's a wild day. I had no real plans for today. I just wanted to get out and I think I'm happy that I get out anyway as always but I think now what I'm going to do is go back around this way here and try and take some of these waves head on because uh, they are quite large that are coming through here and the light now as well does seem to be getting nice in the distance so yeah I'm finished on this side anyway we're gonna go back around upon ourselves and see what I can get with some of the waves that are breaking up and I've got a good, good long view as well along the cliff side so yeah try a couple of shots anyway from here and then yeah we'll continue on and we'll see how we get on from there side now and as you can see here behind me it's quite vicious and quite windy actually it's really really hard now for me to be able to record to camera because the sound is going to be very hard and my back is to the wind at the moment the spray that's coming off these waves as well is absolutely phenomenal so what i've done there is i've used the 7200 handheld and i've managed to get a hopefully a couple of shots of some crazy water breaking along the rocks that are here behind me it's a beautiful uh, set of light as well now that's coming in here as you can see i'm backlit there as it is but we're coming into high tide now so i think it's actually probably going to get more ferocious so i'm going to hang around anyway see what else i can get i'll show you these shots anyway from the rocks that were there and uh, yeah we'll see what else we can get then after that
Right now I've come up onto the cliffside here and I'm actually on the, uh, the grass because it was so windy. Um, I had some beautiful light here, it's just fading here now behind me with some monster waves actually that were crashing against the rocks that you can see here. I've got the long lens on and I'm just basically sniping out some shots to make sure that I can try and capture that action. I've probably taken around maybe four or five hundred frames today um, to be able to capture whatever I can get as the wave is breaking below me. But as you can see on that little bit of a rock here, they were breaking over that and they were actually covering that a moment ago. I think I got one where it was actually completely covering that rock, which is quite a big uh, wave to be able to do that. The light now is going behind the bank of cloud that's here. I don't think I'm going to get to see it anymore, but I might get some residual light as well in the sky. So I'm going to hang around anyway and see what I can get. But some incredible wind, incredible waves, great action as well, and a lot of birds as well going around, which hopefully will be able to help in capturing some uh, interesting photographs from today. But yeah, as always, delighted to get out. I think I got some nice shots. Let's continue on now as I can see these big waves that are breaking here uh, behind me. So hopefully I can capture a few more of those before the day is out. But I'll keep going anyway and I'll check back in anyway before I finish up for today. made a hasty retreat back to the car now because it absolutely opened up in the heavens and the rain now is coming down quite hard. Even though there's light that's behind me, there's nothing really that I can shoot that's going to be able to have a nice shot because of the way that the rain itself is coming. I've constantly having to clean my uh, filters, as you can see here, they're covered in water. Uh, every so often I had to wipe it, which is a uh, case for the day in reality, constantly having to clean the front of the lens. But it was really, really nice anyway here. I'm going to wait now just for a moment because there's that bank cloud and the rain cloud that's actually getting soaked at the moment if that passes away I think I might actually get a nice shot with some nice light as well over Ballycotton Lighthouse so it's been a phenomenal afternoon first afternoon out of 2022 I hope you've enjoyed coming along on the journey with me if it's your first time on the channel please hit the subscribe button give me a like give me a comment and until the next time Schlange Fall. <laughs>